We no finish them one fight us If them they run them no fit catch up I know they from say I too righteous No come they from say you too like us They no get the time but they hate and they bad energy They got my mind on my money Make you dance like broccoli Steady clean like broccoli Steady on my grind no one hear what they want Telling me could deny my fantasy Then one day check if my dad be no rush But it is rush, it is rush well To make this for all sizes, you will need three years of fabric. And if you're using African fabric, you will need at least three and a half years of African prints if you're using African prints. But for this, you will need three years. You will also need to cut out some strips of fabric from a black material. For the type of fabric you need, you can either use chiffon, thick chiffon, or you can use light crepe, or you can use satin, or even African prints. So any type of fabric, as long as it's not stretchy, you can use it for this. Also for the black fabric, you can use satin, or you can use um, silk, you can also use crepe material as long as the crepe is light for the black trimming. Here I have 28 inches as, and it's on fold. So 28 times 2 is what I have here. And the length I'm using is 40 inches. My sewing allowance is also included. So I'm going to fold this again into 4, as you can see. After folding it, as you can see, this is unfold and this side is not unfold. Can you guys see? So this side is the side that is unfold and this side will be the center front and the center back. First, I will cut out the neckline. The neck width I'm using is 2 inches. I will mark it here. Next, the neck depth I'm going to go down by 1.5 inches. I'm going to mark it here. I'm going to connect this to this. I'll cut this out. Next, from the shoulder line, I'm going to come down 18 inches and I'll mark it like this. Next, from the center front and the center back, I'm going to mark a straight line here. I'm going to be using 15 inches and I'll mark it there. So from here, I'm going to come up 3 inches. I'll make a line like this. Next, from this line, I'm going to go out that way. From the center front and center back, I'll go in 20 inches and I'm going to mark it. So I'll go in 20 inches like this. I'm going to mark it here. Next, I'm going to connect this line to this line. From here, from the 18 inches, I'm going to go like this. Next, I'm going to take the measurement of here to here and use it for here. So I'm going to do this and I'm going to do it like this and I'll cut it. Next, this is the sleeve opening. So from here to here, I'm going to come down 20 inches and I'm going to mark it here. So I'm going to connect this line, just be free with it and connect it that way. So I'm going to make this like this. Make it a curve. Let this be a curve. Yeah, let it be a curve like this. Next, you're going to cut all this out. This is very, very simple. This is a very simple and quick dress to make. So I'm going to cut out all these things. So this is what we cut out. I'll go ahead and cut out the sleeve. Remember one is still on fold. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it out. So I'm going to take all this away. And I'm going to take out the back. What we have left is the front. So we're going to work on this front now. Next, from here, I'm going to come down 18 inches and I'll mark it. Remember, I have already taken one inch here. So I'm going to take my measurement like this. And mark it. And I'm going to connect this to this. Next, I'm going to cut this out from here to here.
and I'm going to cut open the front. So I'm going to cut this like this. Next, we'll be sewing this. So I'm going to bring the back again. So this is the back like this. I'll go ahead and place the front. I'll place it front side facing together. I'll go ahead and sew this place and sew this place. As you can see, I have joined this. Can you see? So the next thing I would do is to go ahead and close this place, the side seam, and close the side seam for this. And I'm going to go ahead, after closing it, I'm going to go ahead and hem the lower part. So I'm going to fold it like this and fold it again. And I'm going to sew it all now. <music> Next, for the strip at the sleeve, I'm just going to go ahead and place this like this. What I have here is five inches like this, and I have folded it like this. So I'm just going to go ahead and start sewing this like this. So I'll sew it all around, all the way around like this. And when I get somewhere here, I cut this off and cut this off, and I'm going to join it like this before I finish up on this place also I'm going to go ahead and first of all for this place I'm just going to go ahead and sew this first I'm just going to turn this right side facing together like this I'll sew it first of all turn it over like that and start joining it to the, the and start joining it to the v-neckline when I get to the other side I'll do the same thing on the other side so let's go to the machine now